Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I will have a makeup tutorial for a white party event that we're going to and uh, I decided that I want to film it and I'm going to do something simple but also maybe with a touch of color or a little sparkles. I'll see. Uh, but stay tuned if you want to watch uh, the end result and hope you like it. Okay, first things first, I already put all my skincare and I'm gonna put a little bit of chapstick. I'm using the Summer Fridays uh, lip balm. I really love this one, it's so good, very hydrating. And then I will put my primer and since the event is outdoors, we live in Florida, so it's gonna be pretty hot. Uh, I want my makeup not to melt and to last me all night. So I'm gonna use my Milk Hydro Primer. I really like this one. I, I did not like it at the beginning, but then after using it a few times, I realized that it's a really good one and it really helps me hold the makeup for the night. So let's apply this and then I'll wait for it to dry. Okay, and then after this is dry as a foundation today, I'm gonna be using the Tom Ford Traceless Soft Matte Foundation in shade 1.4 Bone. I really like this one. Uh, it's very light, really like gives me a very um, airbrushed look. So I put a little bit on my hand, like maybe two pumps, and I'm applying it with this dense brush from Marc Jacobs. I've had this forever. And I really like this brush. This foundation is buildable, so you can really uh, build it up with the coverage that you like. Uh, okay, so I apply the foundation and now I will go over with a beauty sponge. This is like a velour beauty sponge from Juno & Co, I think it's called the company. And it's uh, very soft and this uh, will help me take out the excess of the foundation just by tapping. So the foundation really looks like a second skin. And I'll just go over with it like this too. Okay, and then I will use as a concealer this Kosas concealer. On the inner corner, under eye, under eye, inner under eye, I don't know. On the edge. And then I will blend it with a beauty blender. Okay, so I blended this concealer and whatever is left on the beauty sponge i go on top of my eyelid and that will be like that will act as a eye primer so my favorite holy grail uh cream contour cream bronzer is this chanel uh, le beige and in the darker shade i think they have two different shades i got the darker because it's it's pigmented but you can kind of blend it so I will go in with this with a small dense brush. This is from Charlotte Tilbury. I love this. And just go on the highest point of my cheek, trying to contour. And I love this. This is very natural. And again, like it's so buildable. See the difference? Contour, no contour. I blended the uh, cream contour and now I will go in with my favorite holy grail uh, powder and this is prisma libre from Givenchy and I'm gonna get a powder puff dab it dab the excess on my hand and then just look up and then go under eyes to set my under eyes and look at the difference it's like it's so beautiful this powder you have to have this powder And then I will kind of, not fake, but kind of go under my cheekbone to snatch that part. Right and then I will go with, um, oh, and on the powder, I have color number two. And then I will go on with this uh, bronzer from Christine Dior in shade Warm Bronze 5. With a fluffy brush and just go over where I contoured with my cream bronzer to set the cream. I want to 
to put too much on the neck because I don't want to transfer. I have a white dress tonight since it is a white party. So this is the base and then at the end I'm going to put the blush. Now we're going to move into eyes. Now I'm going to move into the eyebrows. I'm brushing them up and then so I'm going to use this Mario palette. I'm going to get this brown color and just go over the crease. With that same color, I'm gonna go under my lower lash line and smoke it out. Then I'm gonna get a little bit of this darker brown and go at the end. It's definitely the palette that I usually get with me when I travel. I'm just cleaning up a little bit the edges. Okay, so I decided I'm gonna go with this bronzy color, my lid. Just has enough shimmer. Tear dot, I'm gonna do this sparkly silver. As you can see, this is very, pigmented and very sparkling. I love that touch color there. And I will intensify a little more the lo lower lash line. And now I'm gonna move into my eyebrows. I will use this Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, Dip Brow Pomade in Soft Brown and just fill in the brows. When I do my brows, I'm really like trying to. I still have I still have to master my brows, like learn how to do it in like a little bit of a time and like get them done right. It's like it's the hardest part. And then finishing up the eyes, I will use this Charlotte Tilbury um, eyeliner in Barbarella Brown. And I will go in my inside my eye on the out, upper lash line and then I will do a little wing. Precise. You don't have to be precise because then I'm gonna go with a very flat small little tiny brush and just smudge it out. I prefer to use brown liners because I feel they're more natural. Okay, and then I am mixing this dark brown with this black from the Mari palette on my brush and just go over wherever I put the eyeliner to set it. And just connect it with your lower. And for good with the eyes, and then now I will put the mascara. I'm not gonna do lashes. I'm not a big fan of lashes, so I'm gonna use this um, Climax Extreme Nars. And now I am going in with this Prisma Libre blush from um, Givenchy. Just dipping it a little bit, removing the excess, and then going on the cheeks. This is like an orangey blush. This also gives you a very airbrushed look. 
And then now to set the whole uh, face, I will use this um, Urban Decay All Nighter spray. And now I'm going to let it dry and I will uh, finish up my lips. I'm going to go do my hair, put on my outfit and show you the final result with my lips. Okay, I'm all ready for my lips. I use the Pillow Talk Medium uh, Lip Liner and the Charlotte Tilbury Cut Walking Lipstick and on top my Lip Dior. Um, put the accessories. This is my handbag and then shoes oh. hope you enjoyed this video thank you for watching subscribe if you like my tutorial and see you soon ciao